Hello, my name is Manfred, and welcome to my kitchen. Today, we're going to make a really, really delicious, quick and easy sandwich that's famous worldwide. We're going to make the Montreal smoked meat sandwich. Oh, and this is so quick and easy. You got the smoked meat, which is thinly sliced, a little Swiss cheese, the bread of your choice, because you know, you're making this at home. Then we got a spread that is made with mayonnaise and Dijon mustard, and then the secret here, we're going to make what is made the homemade sauerkraut with the cabbage, onion, coriander, white vinegar, a little sugar, and this is very exciting. Now, the first thing we always do in the kitchen is wash our hands because when you're out there in the public and you're moving around and touching things and they're touching things, you know, you want to be careful. And when you're in the garden, make certain that you not only wash the hands, and working outside, but make certain that you also uh, clean the fingernails because you're always using the fingernails in the kitchen. Now, this is very quick and easy. The first thing we have got turned on already, the cooker to warm it up. Let's put the fry pan down on it now. And we put a little bit of the oil in the fry pan. Even though this is non-stick, you use the oil for the flavoring to give it the wonderful flavor. Now, Manfred always talk about the pre-prep. This take about three minutes to get ready. That's all. First, we got the cabbage, which is uh, one cup or 250 milliliters. Oh, hear that? There we are. Into the sink. That's it. Now, with the cabbage, we are going to include, notice how finely chopped here, let me show that. See how finely chopped that onion is and the cabbage. Oh, yes. Now, you can do this with the knife, uh, which you can learn how to do on manfreedinthekitchen.com. Or you can use uh, one of the, uh, oh, what's the word that Manfred looked for there? Uh, what? Oh, the blade. Yes, 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 yes. Sometimes Manfred forget these things. Now, look how fast this goes, okay? Spread the onion around. There we are. Now, Manfred is going to add the coriander for the flavor. Now sprinkle that all over, just like that. That's it, they'll see how little there is, but the flavor will be incredible. That's it, just like, oh, look at how quick this is. Now, we're adding a little bit of the sugar. This is the sweetness. Sprinkle that around, oh, that looks like enough. You know, you gotta make the choice how much you put in there. Oh, that's very hot. Manfred is going to lift that off. That was very, very hot. Now a little bit of the vinegar. Oh, that works perfect. Look at that. There we are. All we're doing is just softening this up to make our own sauerkraut. Oh, the f you can smell the vinegar, the sugar working together. We're going to set that there just for the second. Back here, we got two sliced bread. You can use the bread of your choice. Take that out. This has now been used, so that goes into the garbage. Set the bread down side by each. There you are, you got a pair. One right, one left, that's it. Oh, the sugar we don't need anymore. We'll set that out of the way. Back here, okay. Oh, we're going to get, oh, we got some dill pickle for uh, the garnish. We got the meat and we got the cheese. There it is, very, very quick. Close that up. The first thing that we're going to, there, does that look good? This doesn't look so good, does it? Nope. Manfred, get rid of that. Into, oh, into the recycle. The recycle goes outside in the compost. Make sure that's always kept clean in the kitchen too. Okay, let's heat that up a little more now. In here, we have you can see the mayonnaise and a little bit of the mustard in there that we have. Uh, you can put them both in the same place. Because, oh, that just gets quick, very hot. Back here, let's get the stir. Put them in the same uh, bowl because you're going to mix them together like this anyway. There, that's it. Now, when that's mixed together, the mayonnaise and the mustard, put it on the bread. Make certain that you get it right to the edges. Oh, that's perfect. If you put it to the edges, the kids and the friends and the family are going to enjoy it because they will eat the crust at the same time. Now, notice, Manfred have a little bit of the leftover here. Put the lid on it. 
Manfred will put the label on this, put it into the, uh, uh, into the uh, refrigerator for later because we got the leftover. Now, let's just heat this just a touch more there. That will come back. Oh, that's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Take one slice of the Swiss cheese, put on here. Take another slice of the Swiss cheese and put on there. Let's take the meat. Take the, the, and you can get this thinly sliced at the market or from the grocery store where you go. Just ask them, they will, they, they will do that for you. This is going to be one delicious sandwich, let me tell you. There we are, oh yes. That is just excellent. Oh, that's ready now. Can you see how that is? That's just perfect. It has just been heated through. We've made our own homemade sauerkraut. Let's put a little bit on here. There we are. Oh, look at that. This is going to be one delicious sandwich. Oh, that is just excellent. Set that down. Make sure the handle is so that nobody can kick the, catch it, pull it over on top of themselves. Let's put this on top of here, just like that. We can reuse this plate here. This will go into uh, be cleaned. That will be cleaned. There we are. We are finished. We could cut the dill pickle, but we're just going to set it on the side like that. Hey, there you are. There's the perfect Montreal smoked meat sandwich. Oh, with the homemade uh, sauerkraut. That's enough. You kids, you beginning cook, you new cook, your friends, your family are going to love it. I am no chef, but I can cook it. This is delicious. Cut. Cut.